Hey guys. In this tutorial we will be talking about the fundamentals of the helix curve along with its drawing procedure. A helix is a type of smooth space curve, that is a curve in three-dimensional space. It has the property that the tangent line at any point makes a constant angle with a fixed line called the axis. Examples of helices are coil springs and the handrails of spiral staircases. Helices can be either right-handed or left-handed. With the line of sight along the helix's axis, if a clockwise screwing motion moves the helix away from the observer, then it is called a right-handed helix, if towards the observer, then it is a left-handed helix. Handedness, or chirality, is a property of the helix, not of the perspective, a right-handed helix cannot be turned to look like a left-handed one unless it is viewed in a mirror, and vice versa. Initially, draw a circle of required diameter, 40 in this case, and divide it into 12 number of divisions. Then, name the intersection point successively from 1 to 12. Draw the front view of the cylinder, which is basically a rectangle, of height 75 mm. Now, Mark the pitch of the helix along the height of the cylinder, 50 millimeters in this case. Now, divide the pitch of the curve into 12 number of divisions and mark successively from 1 to 12 as shown below.
Now, project the lines vertically upwards from each points. Finally, the intersection of the vertical line from a particular point, say 2, with the horizontal line from the corresponding point, 2 in this case, represents the position of the point at that instant. Proceed similarly to obtain the intersection point of the lines 1, 2 and so on. Finally, join the thus obtained intersection point to obtain the helix curve of one convolution. <laughs>